here's how to get paid. One of the hardest things about babysitting? Discussing money. It's awkward, and when I first started babysitting, I wasn't sure what to charge, and I was afraid to just throw out a number. Wait, you charge how much? So, I didn't. I just let them decide what to pay me. That was a mistake. I'm all out of cash. Oh, but here's two coupons for free ice cream. I needed to get my act together, and fast, because I can't pay for this with coupons for ice cream. Plus, babysitting is hard work. I realized that I was providing a valuable service, and I deserve to get paid. You do too, and it's easier than you think. Here's how to do it in three easy steps. Step one, decide what to charge. The rate is going to be different depending on where you live, how experienced you are, and whether you've completed a training course, like Safe Sitter. A trained, experienced sitter can charge more. If you really don't know what to charge, ask your friends how much they charge, or use minimum wage in your community as a starting place. If you get paid $8.50 an hour to bag up burgers and fries, you deserve at least that much for caring for somebody's child. Remember, keep it simple by charging by the hour. But if you're babysitting more than two kids, it's okay to charge more. Step two, when people contact you about a babysitting job, tell them what you charge. I charge $10 an hour, will that be okay? And let them know how you prefer to be paid, cash, check, or mobile transfer. A lot of people don't carry cash anymore, so give them an advance warning if that's how you wanna be paid. That's it. Oh, wait a minute, I said there were three steps. Give yourself a pat on the back. You are the babysitting boss. Now go spend some of that well-earned money. Hey, have you subscribed yet? Hit the button, yep. That one right there. And never miss an episode.